Coach, to come in here, you guys are down four of your top scorers. What did it take to, to win this? Uh, I mean, we did it together, and I think that's the you know the enjoyable part about it. Um, being in these moments, you know, with your back against the wall, so to speak, um, and knowing that it's not going to be one guy that picks up the slack for everybody. Um, and everybody who played contributed. And, you know, to watch them celebrate one another, to watch them share the game, uh, the way we were passing the ball, you know. Um, I mean, it was, it was great to watch. And then, you know, to defend the way we did, come out there in the third quarter, hold them to 16 points, right, 23 points in the fourth. Um, I mean, it was a phenomenal performance on both ends of the floor, and it was a group effort. You mentioned the defense, and I just want to make sure I had this. I remember you guys had 16 um, fast break. You get 16 fast break points in the first half, zero in the second. Like, what did you guys do differently on the defensive end? Uh, we, we just talked about getting back, um, and again, it was together, uh, and then taking away their strengths. Uh, DeRozan uh, and Kobe White were both getting to their right hand early in transition and attacking that pocket, and I thought our guys did a great job of executing uh, the game plan and shifting, taking away that right hand uh, and slowing them down as a unit. Before this game, we talked about how you wanted Craig to just be aggressive, but also like navigating through the being aggressive and you know, finding your teammates. How do you describe what he did tonight? Uh, I mean, it's almost, you know, the triple double watch, um, you know, organizing a game creating for everybody else and then doing all the little stuff and the dirty stuff that he just has a knack for. He just has a way to come up with the ball, uh, rebounds, gets deflections and steals. Um, and I mean, he's a really good scorer. Uh, he can get to the mid range and make shots over the top of people. Um, he's got great touch around the basket, but we talked about it before. He's just so poised. Like you never saw him get sped up. You never saw him uh, be rushed. You know, he just got to his spot and did his thing. Um, so I thought he did a great job tonight. What did you think about Max Struson closing out? He had 10 of the last 16 points for you guys. Yeah, I mean, you know, that's one of the things about, you know, Max that I love is his courage. Um, you know, he obviously understands the moment and, you know, the moment's not too big for him. You know, he knew down the stretch um, that he was going to have to be the guy to help close this thing out. And, um, you know, obviously, you know, missing the bodies that we are who typically have the ball in those moments. I thought he did a great job of just rising to the occasion, um, you know, putting us on his back and helping us finish the game. Talk about uh, triple double watch. Jay was also on triple double watch. How important was he today, especially with Vucevic? Yeah, Jay was a beast. Um, you know, to go out and do what he did. You know, help us get extra possessions. He had eight offensive rebounds. Um, you know, he was uh, elite in the paint on both ends of the floor. Um, you know, again, this is, you know, you know, this is what team is all about, right? Like you see where we are what we're missing and, you know, to have the ability and the courage and the want to uh, go out and dominate a game to impact because, you know, he wanted us to help. He wanted to help us win, um, you know, speaks to his character, just how special of a person and a player he is. Ball was obviously hopping around three guys nearly in double digit assists. How important was that for you guys? And was that something you had planned or something that just happened? No, we know that, you know, with the group that we have, um, you know, we got to move it and we got to create for one another. Um, and the guys took it to heart. You know, they, they want to, again, do it together. And it's been impressive to watch them play a selfless game um, where it's not a matter of who gets the shot. They just give it to the right person uh, and let the right person take the shot. What does it say about the resiliency of your team that you were able to beat a really good Bulls team that's been on a roll like uh, they have been? I mean, it's, you know, again, it, it's the grit, um, it's the physical and mental toughness. And, you know, it, it's, it's one of those things, a group of guys that just don't want to disappoint one another. Um, so they went out and, you know, played the game purely on both ends of the floor. Um, but it just speaks volumes about their character um, and their commitment to each other.